Right! Welcome back to Resident Evil Director's Cut. Uh, uh, where we last left off, we were going to go through the Valley of the Snakes. We should use that crank. This is quite an annoying piece here. Right. The water is running down the opposite side. Which means we can't go back. Without turning that crank. But, now, this is the strangest part. We have to run through these trees. And for some never explained reason. Poisonous snakes fall from these trees. Never explain why they're a poisonous. I mean, is that a hazard of the area? I don't know. Were they there before? Right. Now, there's no dogs out here. I was going to say, I bloody know there's dogs out here. Right. Can't go through there yet. No idea why those dogs weren't too bothered by us, but it's only a good thing. More herbs. My my. Uh, oh shit. More dogs too. Oh you son of a bitch. I forgot about those. Shit, move it, Jill. Right, uh, mm. Now. I think we'll grab those herbs on the way back. Uh, yeah. We'll chew on that one. Wait a minute, I think there's more herbs here. Ah, uh, they're only blue herbs. Still, we'll have them. Now we need that statue. Very important is that. And that needs to go down there. cover that hole because if you don't do that you get whipped by a vine <laughs> now is this the save room or is the other one the save room nope the other one is the box room and we need to visit the box because our pockets are stuffed That will be this will be the box room. Yeah. Well, there should be a few goodies in here. Explosive rounds. Oh yeah, of course. Um <coughs> yeah. I actually prefer uh, I'd prefer to get some shotgun shells. To be honest, much more useful. Uh, right, now. Right, let's ditch these blues. Very unlikely we're going to need them. There's always a chance, that's why I pick them up still, but it's pretty unlikely. Certainly have those. We'll have that for the hell of it. Although, <clears throat> we're not really going to need that unless we screw up bad somewhere. Right, 
Uh, we'll put those back in the box as well. Right. Um, yeah, I'm getting confused again with the remake. In the remake, there's a box of shotgun shells in there. Now, we'll have these. I suppose the advantage is, if you get poisoned, um, at least you know you have uh, plenty of herbs at your box room. As long as you can get back in time. happy with the bazooka being up there. Or the lighter. Or the crank. I do like to have some order of things here. For some reason I always have my health uh, items above that line and everything else below. Also, usually I um, search, uh, I usually sort weapons out and key items out, uh, but I really can't be bothered this time. More green herbs. Bloody hell, we're well stocked actually for healing items. Right. Oh, you silly. Silly me. Right. Now, let's explore. Bloody tea's gone gold. That's sure to hamper us. Right. Zombie? Yes, there are zombies. But we're going to get in here first. I thought there was a clip in here. Still. We can drain this water. We will unplug it, yes. Ah, yes, there was a key. Will you take? Control room key, yes, because we are going to need that. <clears throat> right, zombie. Has he had enough? He has, and he has a friend. a key item as well. Will you take the red book? We will. Right. I think there's a journal or something around here. Nothing unusual. Can we not search that? The desk is locked. Yes, we will. I was going to say, I'm sure shotgun shells in here. There is indeed. Damn, I'm good. Right. Now, we will go back and put those in the box. 
kind of in retrospective, we didn't need to kill those um, zombies, but never mind. We can certainly afford to take a few hits with the amount of health we've got. Uh, I wish you could just drop them on top of each other. Didn't have to put them in your inventory to combine them. <clears throat> A little bit annoying, but... I believe they sorted that in the newer ones. Right. I don't think we can use that red book yet either. But we'll keep it on us. In fact, for some reason, I want to search it. I'm pretty sure it's only in the remake. Because it's a blank book, yeah. Okay. Yeah, in the remake, I'm pretty sure there's something in it. Or no, actually, I'm thinking of a completely different book. Never mind. Right. Spider room. I think this is the first time we meet spiders. Spiders aren't too much to worry about most of the time. <coughs> That's important. Looks like a clock dial. 958. Some kind of code? Quite possibly. Now, I believe that lets us in to the coded door. Well, he's not going to get us, no. Sure there's a clip there, yep. Lovely. Certainly we'll take that clip. That is an ink ribbon, which we certainly don't need. And out the door. Really, really no point fighting spiders. They are quite tough, they can take a few shots, but they're really not much of a threat, so... <clears throat> Moving on. And you really don't want to get poisoned. Now, I believe... Alright, maybe not just yet. Can't go through there. There's a key here, which we really need. And a massive beehive. Bit of an odd enemy. Giant bees. They're not very tough. Uh, or should I say they're not, again, they're not much of a threat. Now through here, oh yeah, actually through here there's yet more herbs. Three of them. Icarumba. Alright, we'll have more. Although that is going to mean another trip back to our box. See what I mean though? All those people that say, oh, remember the original Resident Evils where he's always struggling for, for ammo and things like that. When you go back and play them, you really weren't. There's plenty of ammo. It always was. I think the remake is a little bit different. I think they really kind of went really stingy on it, especially in the beginning. Um, I remember when I first got it for my GameCube, I remember the beginning of the game was really like, oh crap, more zombies but i got no ammo. But um, yeah, that's one thing that always annoys me when they go on about Resident Evil 4 and 5, like, oh but in the original we never had any ammo, we never had any ammo. It's like, yes you did, you had more ammo than you could use. You should try playing the game again. 
Right. That's not to say that I'm 100% behind the new ones. But 4 was amazing. And the one on the 3DS, the new one, uh, what was that called? Um, Resident Evil Revelations, the one that's on the 3DS. I brought that on day one with the circle pad. Now that is fantastic. That is absolutely brilliant. <clears throat> In fact, that's probably the best new Resident Evil for a very long time. Maybe not quite as good as 4. Maybe. But certainly miles ahead of the 5th one. Which I did also like. I did like the 5th one. But... Yeah, it's a bit awkward that one was. Yes, we shall now throw the key away. I do quite a lot of this game. I've noticed since I've been doing this LP. I do most of this game on autopilot. And just like, you should click, 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 click. Now, I don't think there are zombies in this room. 